She was diagnosed with dementia and Alzheimer's eight years ago, but in Florence Vigod's golden years, she has been a gift to those around her and a true testament to the magical power of music. To the front. Almost a lifetime of Florence Vigod's memories have disappeared. Do you remember your, who your sisters are? Yeah. Who? Sadie and Molly. That's right. <laughs> but her eyes are still bright, and so is her smile. She always had that sense of humor, like a, a, for all our lives. She walks without a cane and doesn't take any medication, but at 102 years old... Her uh, short-term memory is about three or four seconds. What are we waiting for? Well, you're waiting for me to finish combing your hair. Florence has dementia and Alzheimer's. I think you're ready to go. Do you want to come? Go where? To the piano. She moved into this care home about three years ago. It was as though you had uncovered a pot of gold. And that's when everything changed here. Everybody can sing along with you. Florence has been playing the piano since she was six years old. And she remembers. Every morning she plays O Canada, and everybody stands. Some even sing. Sometimes they even dance. Even people that are pretty well non-responsive or non-verbal will smile, will get up and will want to move. Her eyesight isn't great, so she can no longer read the notes. She plays everything by memory and by request. Can you play Take Me Out to the Ball Game? I think so. Yeah? Let's hear it. <laughs> I call it a treat, but usually a treat you don't have every day for so, so much time. And so it's, it's a privilege. I move to it or I get up and dance with it. It depends on the music. Does the so. music make you happy? Yes. In November, Florence turns 103. The plan? And coffee and cookies and cake. And music. There will definitely be music. Yay!